Welcome to a Pinkaging training video. In this training video, we're going to go over the submission options page and how to actually use the software to do such submissions as social bookmarking, RSS submissions, directory submissions, etc. This is where you actually get to use the functionality of the software and where you save massive amounts of time. So first, let's talk about how to get to the doing the submissions. Three things are vital. First, you have to create a project. In this case, we're going to be promoting a couple Pinkaching pages. So we needed to first create a Pinkaching project. Second, we needed to enter in our URL that we want the software to promote. In this case, we're going to promote the root URL of Pinkaching and a blog post we did on Pinkaching's website. And lastly, we need to make sure we go to the settings page and that we have entered in accounts for the software to use for its submissions. If you haven't entered any accounts, you're not going to be able to do such things as social bookmarking and RSS distribution. From the dashboard, to submit something into the software, we'll go to Manage Projects. You would create a project or enter a project by double clicking. Enter a URL or go, uh, in this case I'm going to go to an existing URL I haven't yet promoted. But majority of the times you're just going to click Add New URL and go through this wizard here uh, until you get to the Submissions tab. For this demonstration, I'm going to go straight to one of my old ones. I already pre-entered. Now you can see I want to talk about these available options that you have uh, for you. Um, there, all of these icons are lit up here except for the Status Updater. Now if you get any icon that's grayed out, simply put your mouse over it and hold it for a second and it will give you a message why uh, that feature is grayed out. As you can see here it says message field is empty. And if we go to title, you'll see I haven't entered anything uh, for uh, in this box, so I can't submit nothing. So I won't be able to do a Facebook, Tumblr, uh, or Twitter update, which is just fine in this case. For this promotion, I'm going to be promoting the root URL, so Ping Kaching's homepage, um, and there's really no point in me uh, updating Facebook and whatnot about my homepage because I've, I've already let my fans know about the Ping Kaching homepage. So by updating that status again and telling them about my homepage would just be spamming them. I'm only going to want to give them new content. So I'm going to leave that field blank, but I am going to go to social bookmarking. Um, and social bookmarking is this uh, delicious icon here. Uh, so I'll click social bookmarking. And you can, it'll let you, me know what project and what URL I'm about to uh, promote. And it says what function I'm going to be doing in the top right. So social bookmarking. Here we have uh, different tabs. Ready submissions are, are sites that I can submit to that are waiting for me. Finished are ones so I can view what I've done in the past for this URL. And failed will just store all the ones that failed so you can try them again at a later time. Let's go to the ready and uh, I'm going to select them all. I'm going to do, since this is my home page and I really want to drive as much authority and a traffic as I can, I want to submit this to all the social bookmarking sites. I'm going to uncheck slash dot because that doesn't really apply um, I don't really want to submit to slash dot, so you can kind of customize these as you go, this list. Uh, and I'm going to change this, it went to business here, I'm going to go and make sure that's uh, at technology, so you can customize the categories. The rest of these categories, uh, when it says NA, don't panic thinking that the software is doing something wrong. It simply means that these social bookmarking sites do not support a category um, so there's no, no category for the software to select. They'll just pick up your keywords and whatnot. So there's, there's nothing wrong here. It just means that there's no category uh, that's necessary. Now that I have everything selected for social bookmarking, I'm going to click Submit. And you'll see it's kind of hard to see. It's kind of gray, uh, depending on your monitor. It'll say, Started, Please Wait. And that means it's doing the submission process. And it'll give you a green success message when it's done. And then if we go here to the bottom left-hand corner, you'll see a status bar. So you'll know it's running, you'll know what percentage it's, it's uh, at, and then I'll have a stop button. You can actually stop the submissions at any time midstream. And here we go, we have a site asking for CAPTCHA, so we'll just fill that in. 
Not very many social bookmarking sites have CAPTCHA, uh, so CAPTCHA is not a problem with Ping Kaching. Even when doing directory submissions, we right now have uh, over 500 directories we submit to, and none of them require CAPTCHA. In the future, when we start adding more sites that do require CAPTCHA, we'll have a built-in CAPTCHA solver, uh, but right now that's completely unnecessary with Ping Kaching because there's only two, three sites that require, require CAPTCHA, so it really doesn't take any of your time at all. Now, look at this. We have all successes. We, simply as that, went and submitted to all these sites, which has saved me uh, probably 10, 15 minutes uh, already. And you'll see here an error message saying upgrade Wong account. Now, these success messages and these error messages are actually clickable, so you can diagnose the problems or confirm that something actually was submitted. So you'll see here if I click this, uh, Mr. Wong is actually now a paid service, so you have to pay uh, $2 to get a paid account so you can promote. Um, in my opinion, it's worth it because uh, it's only $2, but um, for those of you who don't want uh, to pay $2 to submit to Mr. Wong, just go to the settings tab and remove them from your social bookmarking list and you'll never, you'll never have that problem again. So simple as that, we have finished social bookmarking. Now, you can click this back arrow to go back to this main screen here, or from the social bookmarking, you can simply click uh, the, R the different icons right here that you want to hop to. Um, so since this is a root URL, pinkaching.com, I'm going to want to distribute my RSS feed. So I'll simply click the RSS icon, and you'll see that I actually have already in the past uh, distributed my RSS feed for Pinkaching. Um, so you'll see nothing is under ready, but it's under finished. That's because I've already done it, and you can't resubmit the same feed to the same sites. All that would do is spam them. There's no advantage whatsoever. So this is not an error. It just means we're completely done with that. Now we'll hop over to directory submissions. The directory submissions tab takes a little bit to load. That's because it's loading, you know, over 500 directories off of uh, our server onto your machine, local machine, um, and we store that information on the cloud because it's always being updated as we add and remove uh, directories. We'll go to the ready submissions, and you can see all the categories. It displays what categories I'm going to submit to, and we have all these sites uh, selected. I'm just going to click uh, submit, and then I'm going to skip. Um, I'm going to skip because this is going to take a little bit of time. So I'm going to hit submit, and I'm going to skip ahead. Uh, before I skip ahead, you'll see with directories we actually submit three at a time to help speed up the process. Um, in the future, we're going to add in the settings page where you can display your internet speed. So that way for people who have really fast computers and fast internet, you'd be able to maybe do 10, 15 submissions at a time, which would, you know, make the submission process four or five times faster. All right, I'm going to hop ahead here and uh, let this finish.